Hi guys, welcome back to the next episode of the Sims 4 Joy of Life Challenge. We are back today and let me tell you loves, I have so many things planned for today's episodes. I have done for today's episodes, plural, episode. I have done loads and loads of things in the background ready to prep for this episode. So it's going to be really fun. However, you might also notice some messages right over here and these are from our friends over on Twitch. I normally stream on Twitch and YouTube, but for some reason YouTube is having tech issues today. So we're only streaming on you uh, on Twitch today. Anyways, Twitch is here to come and greet you. So if you guys do want to go ahead and follow me on my Twitch or my main YouTube channel, the links for both of those are in the uh, description below. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy today's video. Let's go and play the game today. So we're joined by our pretty, pretty Neve, and Neve's actually pretty old now, I'm not gonna lie. We're still currently on generation one of this challenge because officially we haven't finished with generation one. We've still got um, things to do with Neve. So we need to max her baking skill, which I believe she's in at level nine right now. And I think that might be the only thing that we have to do. I think that that's it and then we're done. So maybe we could get that done today. Maybe we can officially finish up with generation one of this challenge and move on to generation two um, in the next episode. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. I, I mean, I kind of like to leave it on like a round number. Today's episode is episode 29. So I don't know, maybe we leave it off for the next episode. I don't know, anyways. <laughs> right, we're back. So I wanna update you guys on everything that I've done in the um you know the planning of today's episode just to make sure that you guys know whereabouts we are in our sims lives so here we have oh wait actually i'm just thinking if you guys are watching from youtube like the edited episodes i don't know if you guys would have had a chance to have seen the house renovations that we've done yet because the last few streams that we've done also i'm realizing that this hallway is really dark so let me just buy some lights to go in here um hold on let's grab do we have any lights downstairs? We have these ones. Oh, and I'll bring this light upstairs too. Uh, we'll do one light there and one light there. Like that. Yeah, there we go. Okay, sorry, I'm just, just making sure this looks better. All right, so if you guys uh, didn't see the last four streams, I believe it was, we have literally been spending the entire time renovating in the Joy of Life Challenge. So we've renovated the entire upstairs of the house. In this room, we have Graham's room and we went with a Harry Potter nerdy feel for him. Obviously he is a geek um, and yeah, he's just a huge nerd. He's the sweetest boy ever. He's, he's really sweet, but he does struggle with his confidence. He does struggle to make friends. Um, so we gave him like the coziest little, you know, nook for him to have. He also um, is a geek as well and he loves playing video games. So we also bought him his first video game setup. And he even has, can you see this? He even has a um, little like, uh, I don't know, I think it might be his phone or something set up. So I'm thinking maybe we could get him into like online streaming and we could get him streaming with like a VTuber. That would be really cool. So yeah, that's what his uh, little, you know, cozy Harry Potter nook is looking like. And next up we have Reese. And um, Reese is currently downstairs. Just ignore him. <laughs> so we finished up with Reese's room. Now, Reese is our open minded, unflirty artist. He is absolutely amazing at art. So you can see in his room, we went with a really grungy, um, artistic, you know, but also very plant, airy. It's just a really nice, you know, relaxing room. I d well, I say it's relaxing while it's got like dirt all over the floor, but I don't know. I. I, I feel relaxed when I look at this room. I really do, especially with this painting up here. So like he's got his candle going. He's got his uh, record player over here. He's obviously very vintage, you know. Um, we've also got, yeah, some paintings some posters. Um, these are all the post uh, paintings and like crafts that he done as a kid growing up. So he has a lot of different ones, but hopefully we can replace these because these are like back when he was like six, seven, eight, nine, you know, when he done these. So we need like some updated ones. This is the first uh, painting that he's done as a as a teenager. So basically, when he turned 14, he painted this. So yeah, anyways, it needs a bit of work. It's better, it's, honestly, it's better than what I could do now at the ripe age of 23. So I've got no right to talk. <laughs> I really don't. Um, right, next up, we have our heir's bedroom. This is our baby Ginny's room. We have gone with a pink princess um 
you know, chef's dream. So she's very, very into her, um, her cuisine. She loves cooking and she is also super high spirited. So she's very, very playful, very energetic. She's very happy in life. So hopefully her, um, yeah, her room kind of represents this is very chaotic, very messy. That's kind of the vibes that she gives me. I feel like she's a little bit of a messy, messy girl. <laughs> Who's gonna be the next heir? The next heir is Ginger. She's currently playing in the bathroom with a toy, but yeah, she is our Gen 2 heir. <laughs> Samuels, thank you so much for the Prime sub. Thank you, thank you. And Tissia, sorry, I completely missed that one earlier as well. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Um, okay, so yeah, we um, have finished up with Ginger's room. Um, so her room's, yeah, look, got loads of like, we've got like little fake whisks in here. So all of these items, they're just for aesthetics. However, this item over here is actually a chef's kitchen, but kids can use it as a custom modded uh, item. So she can actually go over here and make food with it. She can make like sandwiches and gummy bear pancakes and things and she can play with it. So this is helping her, you know, prepare for Gen 2. Um, we also have a shared bathroom for the kids upstairs as well. So this is um, Ginger and Charlotte's bedroom. As you can see, they both got access to this. So it's a little bit more kid friendly in here. Whimsy and joy of life, Gen 2 mares, airs be messy. I, honestly, I don't know what's going on with my two challenges. It's going to be so fun. Um, okay, next up, we're in Charlotte's room and just ignore her. She's currently doing a burpee uh, workout. So I know her arms are like ridiculously long, but honestly, there's a swimmer in there. Like, <laughs> there really is. Um, so for Charlotte's room, we went with wellness active queen, who's also very, very popular in school. Um, so she's like Queen Bee, basically. She's got everything in here. She's got her makeup. She's got her water bottle. Um, she's also got loads of like, she's got a jump rope over there. She's got her weights, um, stuff that she'd take to the gym with her. She's got like, yeah, dumbbells, uh, sorry, kettlebells over here and a yoga mat that she just pulled out. She's also got all of her makeup and hair ties and stuff in here. So yeah, she's literally got everything. No, she's not in the football team. We're going to get her to do cheerleading because... She's just that girly. <laughs> but also I can imagine that this is one of her like crushes growing up, you know, like one of her crushes for like, um, for soccer or football, whatever, whatever it's gonna be called in the US. Um, well, technically they're in Italy. So it's probably is football. But yeah, um, I can't imagine that that's someone that she fancies growing up. And then lastly, we have Neve's bedroom and we went for a really tranquil green bedroom, very, calming energies in here because honestly do they need it in here we have a picture of neve and emiliano at their wedding that i took we have neve's hair dryer in here uh, we also have some collections uh, we have emiliano's watches kind of imagine that this is a watch that like got passed down from his dad um and was given to him we've also got some rings in here uh, which are a combination of neve and emiliano's we've got some um perfume and jewelry that is Neves, and yeah, a little candle and um oh my lord, <laughs> sorry, I just zoomed out and <laughs> got a whole vision. Um, and then we yeah, we've got another picture of them when they were younger with the kids. Look at them. This is little baby Charlotte and Reese in that picture as toddlers. Like, please tell me, look, look at this. That is that is so cute. Um, uh, yeah, and then we've also got their wardrobes in there, and then there is their ensuite. Again, we went, we kept the green, cozy you know, tranquil vibes in here. And that is pretty much it. Oh, and also this um little like console outside, um, which has got some of the family stuff on display. We've got some boxes in here. We've also got like the money jar, you know, like where you just find like pennies and put them in. And we've also got this really cute picture of um, Neve and Emiliano at their wedding and also Ginger and Graham um, as toddlers at their wedding as well. So yeah, I've added in lots of pictures downstairs uh i think you guys should have seen this the only thing is is i've added in a few extra pictures so we've got um this is ginger and graham uh, at their birthday party when they turned six five i think that was their fifth birthday party honestly i should probably start naming these just so i don't you know what, excuse me anyways um <laughs> i was like oh, what is this um yeah i wish probably start renaming these and the family photos, we've seen these ones before. This is obviously the classic family photo. And that is that is it. And this is all we've got so far. Um, the downstairs, you guys would have seen. The kitchen, you guys would have seen. So 
yeah, that's it. We're we're pretty much back to where you guys were. <laughs> Mods be wild in like they are going crazy right now. They really are. So the bits I wanted to tell you guys about was I went in. So over the last two streams, we did makeover streams. We grabbed some Sims off the gallery that you guys made. We gave them makeovers. We aged them down to children and teenagers and added them into the game. And hopefully the kids will meet them at school. So what I went ahead and did is actually made all of the kids their own groups and added all of those kids in. I also added in loads and loads more Sims. So I'm going to introduce you guys to some of the social groups that we've got. So first up, we've got Charlotte's friends. And obviously this is Charlotte. She's also got this guy that she's really, really close with in school. Obviously, uh, Charlotte's been going to school for like probably a year now and we still haven't joined her yet. So I'd say that she's like a year in, but she has this guy that she's really good friends with. His name is Raylan Rollins. And uh, let me just tell you, Ra Raylan, sorry, Raylan Rollins. I didn't actually do anything with this. All I did was have them introduce themselves to each other and somehow they have maximum friendship. I'm guessing it's because of their amazing compatibility, which I did not plan for. I did not plan any of this. It just happened. So anyways, this is her bestie um, who she also finds really attractive and they also have an amazing connection. So if that ain't boyfriend material, like I don't know what is. <laughs> so the game's pretty much telling me this is about to be her boyfriend. And also he is a big old snack. So I'm more than happy with that. Uh, we've also got another friend of hers. She's also got amazing compatibility with. This is Tamia Foreman, who was someone that we gave a makeover to on stream. Um, she's really close friends with her as well. So she's in her friendship group. Um, so Tamia, I'm um, actually, I, uh, wait, am I going to need to do that? I don't know if I'm going to need to do that today. Anyways, um, I was just thinking about something. Just ignore me. Uh, we've also got Regina Conn who is um, a cheerleader. She's in cheer. I'm hoping that she is going to be someone that the kids can, um, uh, sorry, that Charlotte can do her, like she needs to do a tryout to be able to get into cheer. So I'm hoping that she can get in there and you know, um, she will let us in basically. <laughs> they're only acquaintances, they're not even friends yet. And last up in Charlotte's group of friends is Ty. This is him. Uh, she also perceives him as very attractive. However, she does think he's kind of weird, um, but they do have amazing compatibility. So Regina, ha, huh? the mean girl reference. She is a cheer friend. Yeah, I kind of imagine Regina being um, like the cheerleader, but hey, who knows? Regina's, Regina's a cutie. We'll get a chance to meet them at school anyways. Um, so next up is Reese's group of friends. Now in the last episode, I was telling you guys that Reese, obviously he does art but I also wanted to get him into being a bit more rebellious. I kind of imagined that he is going to go down the route of like smoking pot and like, you know, weed basically um, and painting and just chilling out with his friends. Nothing crazy. Like I'm not talking about like, he's going to be doing like strong, hard drugs. I, I don't think so. I think it's just more of like smoking weed, painting, spray painting, you know, getting into a little bit of trouble, but like nothing crazy. Yeah, I kind of imagine him as like the stoner kid. You know what I mean? Um, so he has a, a group of stoner friends. Well, they're not all stoners. Uh, pretty much all of them are though. So he's got Demarcus, um, who is another guy in his friend group. Um, and Marcus, Demarcus doesn't actually like Reese right now. He kind of thinks he's distant. He's un inapproachable, but they do have good compatibility. So hopefully they'll sort of bond together. Um, Demarcus is currently studying and he really wants to be, you know what? I get Jeremy Gilbert vibes so much from Reese. Like that is exactly who I imagined when I thought of it. So yes. Um, yeah, Demarcus, I get, um, uh, he is studying to be an architect so he's not going to be going into like artwork exactly, but he is, he's going into being an architect. So yeah, he's, uh, he's pretty cute. We've also got Jaya who, let me tell you, this girl is so, so good looking. Like I, I am shocked that he only finds her just attractive. Like, it, uh, okay. Maybe it's because he's unflirty. It might be that, but I don't know. He needs his eyes cleaned. I think he might need glasses because she is like a 10 out of 10 snack. So I don't know what he's thinking. Anyways, he thinks that she's kind of immature. And again, he seems distant and approachable. I think everyone's getting this idea that like, that Reese is really inapproachable, which maybe he gives off those vibes to begin with, but he's actually a really sweet guy. I think people just need to get to know him. So maybe there's gonna be like a, there's a distant relationship going on here and it might end up turning into something. 
you know, I, I hope so. <laughs> but right now, he's not seeing Jaya as, as a girlfriend. So I don't know, maybe something will come of it. Um, and in their group, they've also got Beckham Hale. And this is also another guy, um, another one of their stoner friends. Again, everyone finds Reese to be really unapproachable, which is really weird. But anyways, they're all in the same friend group in school. So yeah, um, but I guess Reese is kind of like the left out one because everyone finds him so inapproachable. Um, okay, last up we've got, sorry, uh, last, a second before last, we have Graham. And Graham, our baby, he only has one friend. As I said, he's a geek. He also struggles to make friends. He's quite like insecure. Um, and he's, he's struggled with his confidence growing up. He's quite shy. So he's only got one friend. And this is actually Kiara Patel, who is, uh, you know, in Reese's group, Jaya. That is her little sister. So she goes to the same school as the kids. And she is like the sweetest little girl ever. She's so sweet. She's really, really, um, you know, like nerdy, book smart. She loves like chess and things, which obviously um, Graham really enjoys playing chess as well. He's literally got a chess board literally up here. So I was thinking that we could invite her around to play chess. And I feel like she's got really good bestie vibes for him. So we're going to see how that progression goes with their relationship a bit more. And last up, but not not least at all, this is the most important person is Ginger's friends. And Ginger's actually pretty popular in school. So currently she's got four friends. I do want to add some more, but this is just for right now. First up, we've got Christopher, who she already met at school before. So we gave him a little makeover. I also added in family members for all of these kids as well. So yeah, they're gonna all have, you know, parents and families and things. Uh, we've also got Yasmin Yu, who again, she already knew before we had her meet at school. Last up, we've got Dolce. Uh, sorry, not last up. Second before last, we've got Dolce, who we made on stream in the previous stream. And last up, but not least, is what I'm imagining Ginger's bestie to be. And her name is Dominique. And let me tell you, she is the sweetest little button gem ever. So I'm really hoping that her and Dominique can blend together. Dominique seems like a really, really good balance for Ginger. And I think in the future, she's going to really benefit um, from having Dominique as a close friend of hers because Dominique is very, very grounding. So yeah, hopefully that will come become more of a thing that we'll see in the future. But right now, that is their friend group. I don't want to show too much. Um, that's kind of just where I'm leaving it. So friend groups are done. They've all uh, sort of established themselves at school a little bit. But speaking of, um, I need to get these kids off to sleep because they have school um, tomorrow. So is he okay? I think he's a bit mad. Oh, one other thing that um, is going on is, as you can see, um, our baby. He's really struggling right now. He is feeling bad because he feels he's quite strict towards his family members right now. And also he's feeling very depressed. As you can see, I cheated to get this mood. Like, however, I did not, okay? Technically speaking, um, Emiliano's parents, both of them, just died. So I don't know if you guys saw the last gameplay episode, but the grandparents passed away. Sorry, I've got, I've got a really bad throat today. <coughs> Let me have a drink before I go into the explanation of this. Is someone shrimping over Emiliano right now while he's like half naked? <laughs> Tara, I see you, babes. Someone said, Zaddy, he can be very strict to me. Cauliflower. Cauliflower. <laughs> yeah, so um, Emiliano is kind of going through it right now. He um, obviously, all his family have passed away. So his mom and dad both passed away. So Bernard and Carolina, we got a notification in the previous episode that they had passed away. Um, yeah, we got contacted about that. It's very, very sad. Um, so they are gone. We're hoping that we're going to get a notification sometime soon asking if we want to plan the funeral. So hopefully we will get that. However, um, yeah, they are, they are passed away. So I mean, <laughs> look at him. Just look at him. Like, stop shrimping over. I'm going to get him dressed in a second. Cause of you guys, I'm going to get him dressed. <laughs> so I had um, a few ideas in mind for Emiliano. So actually for all of the characters, every single character in the series, I've written down a few ideas. I asked in my discord uh, some ideas for the characters and what we were gonna go through. So 
Emiliano is struggling right now, and um, I think he's gonna come, you know, with uh, gonna work on some coping mechanisms. Um, well, not good coping mechanisms, but obviously he's really struggling. He's sad. Um, he's very, very upset. It's difficult dealing with loss. You know, grieving is very, very hard, especially when you're talking about your parents. So, I know you, you guys are just absolutely shrimping over this man. Um, so he's really angry right now because he's also feels like he's got unfulfilled dreams. So he feels like he hasn't done anything in his life. He feels like he hasn't done, yeah, basically anything in his life. He feels like he's, he hasn't done anything. So he's very mad. He's also very sad about losing his, uh, you know, his parents. So he is going to kind of lash out on his family members a little bit. So he's going to, um, he's going to be a bit mean. Honestly, he's going to start an argument with uh ginger he's gonna start yelling at her because it is currently quarter past 11 and she's still playing in the uh you know the downstairs bathroom and she's not in bed she's got school tomorrow so he is gonna go yell at her and tell her off for not being in bed right now and obviously most of the time did she just put her she really just put the damn thing in the bath like uh, take that thing back <laughs> Anyways, yeah, he is obviously taking out his um, issues. Oh, she is giving him, oh my God, she is giving him drama back. No, I don't keep dolphins in my bathtub. Why do you ask? Wait, what? <laughs> what are they talking about? <laughs> oh, it's because she's a Simlish native. Wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on. You're supposed to be set language preference. You guys are supposed to be, does Emiliano, wait, hold on. This The game is getting so confused right now. They're supposed to be see speaking the same language. Why are they not? Hold on, we'll wait. Yeah, I don't know. The game thinks that they're not talking the same language, but they are. I'm just going to set his na set native language so that he can also speak. Um, hold on. I'm going to also have him speak Simlish. But I want them to make sure that they're speaking. Can I do this? Actions. Yeah, switch languages. I want them to use uh, Italian, basically. I would. Oh, did someone just say I would love to see his? No, I can't even read that. Out. Honestly, might even get banned for that. Might even get banned for that. Okay. Um. Right. She's currently not going to bed. She's she's back chatting us. Right. Okay. She's not having it. Wait. Wait. What's this? She got a new record. She's the best soccer player in the world. I believe in me. She's so confident right now. Okay, well, she's going to go and give her, her dad some, some shit back. <laughs> um, she's going to go and uh, question his anger. And she's going to go and obviously this is like really out of character for, um, for her dad. Her dad never acts like this. So this is clearly, you know, out of character for him. <gasps> Wait, was Neve unwell? Hold on, Neve is feeling better. Oh, I didn't realize Neve. Neve wasn't feeling very well. She's re she's feeling really headachy. Oh wow. Okay, my bad. She could have just died, and I didn't even know. Like, what the hell? Fair skin. <gasps> Magical trait. Thank you so much for the tier one for thirty months and to Halloween bats as well with the prime sub. Oh my god. Magical trait. That's such a long time as well. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Well, anyways, he's kicked Ginger out. Um, Ginger's gonna go up to bed because obviously she did get told off. So I'm gonna send her off to sleep. Actually, all the kids are in bed other than Charlotte, who decided that um, 12 o'clock at night is a good time to make a waffle, which honestly, facts, I agree. Um, I, I have nothing I have nothing else to say to that. Um, how long is it going to take for this waffle to cook? Is he done using the toilet? He is. Did you get a Christmas ad? That, see, that's the best ad to get, though. If you're going to get an ad, at least it's a Christmas ad. <laughs> oh, he's going off to bed. He's so angry right now. Okay, anyways, Emiliano's gonna go off. World's slowest waffle, it really is. Okay, Ginny's getting in bed. She's gonna go to sleep. Oh, also, guys, I gave Ginny a new hair. Um, so yeah, she's got slightly longer hair. I imagine she's probably growing it out, so. New hair, new haircut. Um, Charlotte, you can go do that and then go grab your waffle. Yeah, so, <laughs> you know, uh, as much as I was thinking going to a yoga class with Charlotte can be a nice, good daughter-father bonding moment. And, you know, that would be the more reasonable thing for him to do. Or therapy, exactly. But instead, uh, Emiliano's going to be dealing with his parents' loss. Uh, slightly, 
less um wholesome and uh um um reasonable you know what i'm saying um so here is probably going to be taking a few trips down the bar i'm not gonna lie um in fact we might even have him go down the bar tomorrow and and start you know th there's a little bit of enzo in him i'm not gonna lie there's a little bit of enzo in all of us but i mean maybe not in all of us but <laughs> certainly in emiliano <laughs> Not, not the cheating aspect of Emilia, uh, Enzo. Well, hey, who knows? Maybe, but I don't, I don't think so. What did you make? Oh, pumpkin spice waffles. The girl knows. The girl knows. <laughs> no beam. Why couldn't you grab us? Just grab a serving. Today. She literally said, "I can't eat these. These are too unhealthy." <laughs> Babes, you literally just spent an hour making these damn waffles. You're gonna eat them. The apple doesn't fall, fall, <laughs> fall far from the tree after all. I would really like to say that like I would expect more from Emiliano. And honestly, I do. But also, he's dealing with grief. And grief can ruin people, literally. So, um, you know, everyone deals with it differently. And it's just going to ha so happen that he's not going to deal with it in, in the best way. Oh no, don't say there's a little bit of Enzo in all of us. It kind of makes us sound we're, like we're all cheaters, which is not true. I more mean the like rebellious sort of, you know, the rest of the side of it, not the cheater side. <laughs> I'd like to think that there's not a little bit of Enzo in all of us in that way. I'd like to think that everyone in this chat is is a loyal, loyal bean. Yeah. When do we play with the bakery? Um, I think we're going to send Neve off to the bakery tomorrow. And then... Um, what I want to do is also um, have the kids start helping Neve with like setting up the bakery as well. We need to start calling en Enzo by his government name. Satan Spawn. <laughs> Evil Dragon, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. What happens if Emiliano gets gets the want to divorce Neve? Um, I'll have them talk about it. What's he getting a call about? Oh, some person's going off the grid. Okay. Oh, wow. Is he leaving? Is he using his sister's bathroom? Yeah, they're going to be pissed if he finds out that he's doing that. Oh, what's up, Queenie? Oh, no. Hold on. I need to find out what's wrong with Queenie. Aw. Reese wants to be friendly with Neve. Will we go to high school? Yes, we will. We will be going to high school. What's up? Oh, baby. She's in need of attention. Okay, go give her a treat. And then we'll give her a little, we'll give her a little uh, praise, and we'll talk to her a little bit, and then we'll we'll go head back to bed because he's got school tomorrow. No, mum and dad can't divorce. I'm not anticipating that they're going to divorce right now. Okay, don't don't get me wrong. Ooh, although Emilio's love life has been pretty drama free. Wait, hold on, hold on. Has been pretty drama free. No breakups, no cheating. Maybe he should write a book to help others be su as successful in romance. Um, he went from. Feeling flirty to then reminding himself that his parents died to then being flirty again. Um, I'm going to have him go wake up Neve. I'm going to have him go wake up Neve. Because he's feeling a little saucy, you know what I'm saying? He's feeling a little saucy. He still wants to ask Neve about her day. What else does he want to do? He wants to compliment her. Okay, well, he's just woken her up. So it better be the best damn compliment ever because I'd be pissed. Um... <laughs> Let's go and um, express our admiration for her. Use protection. Don't worry, we will. We will. And then I'm going to have him also go and compliment her appearance. Talk about how attractive she is. Every day she wakes up, she gets more and more beautiful. Who is awake? Is it is it Reese that I can hear? Yeah, he's up with the dog. Who's the next heir? The next heir is Ginger. Currently our sleeping little baby. Oh, he is. Oh, he is going in with this. He really is. Oh, he's going to go kiss her. <gasps> wait, she's like, sorry, I need to go pee really quick. <laughs> okay, hold on. We'll, we'll wait. We'll wait. I feel like we should make Charlotte invest more time in Queenie. Uh, Yeah, I agree. Is Queenie feeling better now? Yeah, she's feeling a bit better. Okay, good. Right, let's just wait for Neve to finish. And then he's, yeah, he's ready to go again. Um, So we're going to go be romantic. And physical intimacy. I'm gonna have him go squeeze her. <laughs> and then um I'm gonna have them 
do a little bit of uh oh sensual grind yeah. intimate kiss oh wow what is going on here Casper. oh my i feel like i shouldn't be watching this oh this is cute uh, <laughs> suggest yeah. deliciously outrageous acts to try oh, hold on what hold on Hold on, I need to know what's going on here. Did she say no? Wait, did she say no to doing that? Hold on, I'll laugh so damn hard if she said no. Although she isn't, actually, she isn't feeling very well. So I wouldn't blame her for saying no. Okay, well, I just want them to woohoo. Just, just, just go and, go and do your thing, babes, okay? Um, physical intimacy. Go and do your woohoo. Oh, goodness. <laughs> they're so cute. I love them. Oh, no, like, they're such couple goals. <laughs> they're so in love. I love that. I love that for them. Quick spot. No cheating. No non-loyal, you know, family here. All right. They're going to go do their thing. Also, I'm just going to make sure that if they do have protection. Right. He does. He does have some protection. In fact, I'm actually going to send... Did I, did I uh, have him get uh, sterilized? I don't know if I did that. Okay, he used it. Good. See, he already knew. He knew, babes. Use protection. Oh, Graham is awake. He's also using the toilet. I'm going to have to start locking this bathroom so that he, they can't get in here. <laughs> he needs to be neutered like ASAP. Yeah, I think so. I'm, I think I'm going to. Oh, Graham's already awake. Well, honestly, as a, as a gamer, like at the same age as he was, you know what I do in the morning? I'd go wake up. I go make myself some cereal, which I'm going to have him go do. So he's going to go grab some cereal. And then you know what I do? I go straight upstairs and I go play video games before I started school. And I'm going to have him go do the same thing. So let's have him play Sim Scuffle afterwards. <laughs> Are they done? Oh, yeah, I think they're done. Oh, are they going to bed? Yeah. Okay. Anyways, back to sleep, guys. Back to sleep. There you go. These kids need noise cancelling headphones. Yeah, they do. They do. <laughs> um, Remember how when they were at the beginning of the relationship, when Emiliano freaked out when Neve got pregnant? They've come so far. I remember that. I do. I remember that. Is he going to go take his cereal upstairs and play while he eats his cereal? Because honestly, I get that. <laughs> Wait, is he coming downstairs to grab food? He can't even sleep right now. He's gonna come grab a portion of meatballs. All right, he can feed Queenie then. Up early tomorrow. Hope you're well, Lauren. Smile. Have a good stream, Max. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you for the seven months. I hope you have a good day tomorrow, Kieran. Thank you so much. Okay, dog food's there. Did you go? Did you go eat your meatballs? Go eat your meatballs, babe. Okay, eat your Italian meatballs. <laughs> And then go to bed. At six o'clock in the morning. Are you kidding? Okay, then go get some sleep. Right, how are the kids doing? Oh, Ginger's awake. She's ready for school. I'm going to have her go take a quick shower. What does she want to do? She wants to play with her giant stuffed animal and play chess. Mmm, morning meatballs. I don't know. That's not really what I'd be fancying in the morning, but hey. Uh, what else have we got for breakfast, actually? Scrambled eggs with bacon. Yeah, let's grab that. Look at our baby, guys. This is our Generation 2 air right here. Look at those. So cute. <laughs> oh my god, I caught you live. I love your streams. I normally have to watch them back as I'm in Australia. I started to stream myself. I was inspired by yourself and Cosmic Hippie. Um, thanks for being awesome. Sorry I sent this message a few times. That's okay, Becca. Sorry if I missed them earlier. Thank you so much. That is so sweet. Oh, that is so sweet of you. Thank you. <laughs> yes, honestly, I love the fact that the kitchen is huge because Need deserves this like a thousand percent. Are you done with the food yet? Oh, you're coming to clean it up? Oh, that's cute. Oh, what are you, what are, he's being good. He's being really good. Okay, what else does he want to do? He wants to stargaze with Charlotte. That's sweet too. Okay, I, are you ready for school today? Uh, yes, the kids have all got school in an hour. 
So I'm going to have them start waking up. Reese, I feel like would actually end up being late to school most days. So I'm just going to let him lay in. Charlotte absolutely would not because she is the it girl. She needs to wake up and have a shower. And then she needs to go and um, freshen herself up in the morning and do her makeup and stuff. Aww. He's in a good mood. I mean, it's because he got that. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Can Neve make the kids lunches for school? I would love to, but... She's really tired right now, so I'm just gonna let her sleep. <laughs> maybe in, like, I think because she's unwell, I'm just gonna let her sleep, but maybe in another time I will. Is she about to, oh, she's ovulating right now, okay. Oh, Charlotte has chosen this outfit for school today, looking like a cutie. Oh no, she hasn't washed her face. Well, wait, you can't freshen up yet. You need to do your facial cleanser first. Do your facial cleanser and then freshen up. Oh, what's Charlotte doing? Uh, sorry, what's uh, Ginger doing in here? Ginger's just coming to do jump. What an annoying little sister. Like, actually, <laughs> why do I feel like Charlotte would be like, you're doing it wrong. Like, if you're going to do it, then do it right. Like, <laughs> I'm going to have a teaser. Yeah, yeah I like that. I'm going to have a teaser. Uh, tease. Tease mercilessly. <laughs> like, like, if you're going to start doing that in my room, like, you better do it right, babes. Like, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> their relationship <laughs> okay um guys do we go with the teenagers to high school today or should i go with the kids to elementary school what do we think teens okay we'll go with the teenagers today select which students to follow charlotte and reese let us go reese is actually going to be forced to turn up on time today so <laughs> The only thing is, I do want to, like, eventually get a custom high school and place a custom high school in. But for now, it's fine. I did want a custom high school, though. Um, also, uh, Bunny, Bun, Bun, Banary, Banary. Hopefully I got that right. Thank you so much for the Prime sub. And uh, Strunk's count with the follow as well. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Ginger is air, but Charlotte is fan favorite. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, right, everyone's off to school. Um, whilst Graham is at school today, I'm gonna have him actively participate. And while Ginger is in school, she's get currently at C grade, I'm gonna have her work on making friends. Okay, what have we got? They need to learn about their new school from the principal, which is right here. Hi, May. Um, okay, go and greet your principal then. What is going on with the school bus right now? Why does it keep going in and out? <laughs> Joy to leave. Um, okay, they, Charlotte and May both speak, um, okay, they both speak Italian, great. Um, all right, let's do some, wait, how do we do this? We need to learn about our new school. Um, is that in high school? Yeah, learn about new school, there you go. And then Reese, Reese doesn't even care. He's going off to go get food. He doesn't even want to about, learn about his new school. He don't give a F. Oh, there is a pretty girl over here doing doing that work though. We can go say hello to her. Although Reese, I don't know. I don't know. He's not. He's not uncomfortable. He'd be fine. Charlotte is Miss Congeniality. I love that for her. Oh, welcome to Copperdale High School, Miss O'Brien. I hope you settle in without too much trouble. We have two periods, one in the morning, one in the afternoon. You also have exams on Friday and our faculty will hold study sessions after school on Wednesdays. Beautiful. <gasps> Wait, I want to introduce you guys. So this is Jaya. You remember who I was saying? The really pretty girl who is in Reese's gang. This is one of his friends. So obviously he already knows who she is. And this is Raylan, who is actually Charlotte's like best friend right now um obviously she's been coming to the school for like a year so far so although we're like you know you know what i mean although we're, we're talking to the principal about our first day of school we're not really they've actually been coming to school for a while just because we're joining them today um but i'm gonna have her go and say hello to um what can we do can we make small talk yeah i'm gonna go and ask what okay no no i don't want to go with just that um <laughs> i want to Ask him how he is, yeah. The school is so cute. It's a really nice school. It's really nice. It's my favorite one. I always go through and like place a custom school in. 
Uh, I'm kind of down, but thanks for asking. Oh no, why is that? Why is that friend down? Um. Okay, let's try and cheer him up then. We'll give him some affection and express our admiration for him. Hi, TT. Welcome back. Okay, can can the principal like get out of our conversation right now? Because like it's weird. Like we're not interested. <laughs> Okay, right. I need the kids to go and claim a locker. So let's go for... Um, yeah, let's go for this one. And then I think Reese needs to go talk to the principal about the new school as well. So if he could go... Oh, I feel like he just wouldn't care. I feel like he'd just go claim his locker anyways and just like ignore it. <laughs> She switched her fit on the way to school. I think it's because it's cold. I think that's why. Okay, guys. Um, what should I decorate uh Charlotte's why is the light so bright? What should I decorate Charlotte's locker with? What do we think? Mm, why are the Sims like so bright inside here? It's so weird. That'll do. You think preppy? Okay, decorate locker. Um, preppy. Although we do have sports. Let me see what preppy's like. Okay, this one is the preppy one. And then this one's the sporty one. And the sporty one's a bit basic. Maybe we go with preppy. Uh, grunge, goth, gamer, anime. Okay, we'll go preppy for her, I think. I think preppy's best. You guys are right about that one. And then for Reese, um, for Reese, he's very, very artsy. So I could see his locker being really artsy too. So I'm gonna go with grunge. Yeah, I like grunge for him. That one's good. <laughs> yeah, the sporty one doesn't really have enough going on for it, does it? Um, so we need Charlotte to talk to our teacher about curriculum. Where is our teacher? Uh, cafeteria worker. That's a student over there. Oh, class two teacher. Okay, come say hello to this guy. I don't know if, I don't think this is actually her teacher. I think this might be the teacher to the other class. Oh my God, there's one of our other friends, Tamlin as well. Wait, uh, Ta Tamya, Tamya, oh God. Um, okay, I'm gonna have her high school. Wait, is that not an option? Is it because it's not actually her teacher? Is that why? Talk to teacher curriculum. Can she do that? No, she can't. Okay, so she needs to find her teacher. Where would her teacher be? Oh, okay, never mind. We're going into class. Not Tamlin. <laughs> okay, listen, actor is on my mind. <laughs> actor is always on my mind. <laughs> okay, go in. Uh, who is this pregnant girl? This girl's pregnant. Okay, interesting. Okay, what's the class today? Art class. Oh, wow. Reese is going to be so into this. <gasps> Reese is sitting next to his friend, Beckham. Love that for him. Him and his other stone friend. <laughs> um, Let's go. Have some... Should we compliment him? Support his body hair? Okay, no, that's a bit weird. Just go gossip with him. Euphoria, hi. Team pregnancy student. <laughs> Charlotte has gained the acting skill and she's also gained the painting skill. I feel like this class wouldn't really be her thing though. I definitely feel like this would way more be Reese's thing. You're shipping Beckham and Reese, really? Although Reese is, I mean, currently he's straight. Doesn't mean it can't change though. <gasps> Ooh, Reese seems to be getting into character and he likes this acting thing more and more often. He likes acting. That's surprising. Although he does stink. Yeah, the best thing about this high school is it's like the perfect size. The thing that I normally find with high school is it's too big. Um, it takes like Sims ages to get to anywhere. So I always go for the small ones. <laughs> Imagine someone coming up and saying, I love how hairy you are. Yeah, I know. Beckham's really cute, isn't he? He's really nice. I want to get to know him a little bit more. So you guys... Oh, yeah. See, you know what I mean about, like, Charlotte not being interested in this class? She's literally falling asleep right now. 
That's how much she doesn't care about this class. Like, it's just so done already. Um, can she do anything else? I don't think so. Can I please have us who made this high school? I will have to double check. Actually, hold on. Right, so... Um, hold on, I'm going to see if I can find it in my gallery. <laughs> um... A back of the classroom type. Yeah, I don't really blame her, honestly. <laughs> um, okay, where is this high school? Mm -mm -mm. Not the elementary school. I hope I saved it. It's going to be really awkward if I didn't save it. I normally like to do a different high school in every single one of my saves. So there is a chance that I didn't save it. That's not it, is it? Oh no, this is it, this is it. Okay, it's made by Sims on the ropes. So if you type this Crater's name in, um, and then, you know, on the item name, change it to EA Crater. Um, and then, yeah, type Sims, in, Sims on the rope in, and you'll get a link to this one. I just wanna play Sims, but I have to study for my exams. Oh no, actually the kids have got to study for their exams today. <laughs> Oh, wait, no way, Reese. no freaking way. Okay, that is so shocking, guys. So Reese is unflirty, right? Which means he gets tense. He finds it difficult to be romantic in public, but he has a crush on Tamia, who is one of Charlotte's friends. There's no way he has a crush on one of his sister's friends. I mean, I don't blame him, honestly. Yeah, Naomi. <laughs> should I have a go introduce himself? I feel like I should have a go. No, would he do that though? I mean, he's kind of open-minded, but I feel like he's a little bit nervous. I might have him ask his sister to like introduce him to her. But anyways, I'm gonna have her go and talk to Tamia. Um, and she's like, hey girl, like, <laughs> you know, the classic. Um, oh wait, actually, are they talking the same language? They should be. Uh, okay, friendly, um, small talk, ask about a day. I, as much as I like the language barriers mod and I like the idea of my Sims speaking different languages, it doesn't really work when my Sims go to high school and then the, the other kids in the school don't speak the same language as my Sims. Might have to uninstall it. Ah, <laughs> look at her talking to Tamia, so cute. <laughs> Hey girl. Oh yeah, see look, they have literally no idea what each other's like. What, why are they not speaking the same language? She should be, okay, hold on. Control Sim. She's supposed to speak native. Switch. She's supposed to be speaking Tartosian. Back there is Reese looking at her. You can already see her. Okay, they should now be able to speak the same language. So it shouldn't be like so weird. Yeah, there we go. Gossip about a classmate. What I do is disable language barriers for my main sim. Is that, you know what? I might do that for today. I do need to uninstall it, I think. Disable language barriers. Okay, I'm just going to do that. The language barriers mod is great, but it doesn't work for lots like this, you know, like for high school and stuff. It's sad. I heard Demarcus is like super close with. Wait, no way. Hold on. No, no, this is actually tea that they spilled. Okay. Reese has a friend. Yeah. Demarcus, which I'm not going to lie. Demarcus is a little bit of a weird one. Um, but, anyways, it's, it's Reese's friend in his group. Someone said, I heard Demarcus is super close with their pets. Like, super close. You know what I mean? Like, Demarcus is a, it's a bit of a weirdo, you know? Like actually spilling the tea out. <laughs> what is this? Okay, we do need to go study for exams and go get some lunch. So let's go order food. Um, our girl, she's she's a healthy girly, okay? She's a healthy girly. So we're gonna go with tortilla wrapped veggie dog, veggie or veggie slider. <laughs> Not them actually spilling tea. They really are. Um. Oh, is he going to go have a shower? He literally said I stink that much. No, no, just go grab some food. You can go grab a fried chicken slider. 
Hi, Keeper Hockey. I just got here, sorry. I'm like, that's okay, no worries. How are you? Okay, Charlotte's grabbing her food. She's just talking to Tamia. Oh, her and Tamia are like really close already. That's nice. Can we get to know her a little bit more? Get to know. Oh my God. Why is she going through a phase of feeling distant? Are you kidding me? Not the time, babes. I hope that's just a rumor and not true. I, I hope it is. Demarcus seems, he's really nice. He is a little strange, but I don't think like that type of strange. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, I don't think like, like pets strange. He's just, yeah. Did she get her food? Where is her veggie? Hello, I just paid for a veggie slider. What is this? That's not a veggie slider, that's a junior lunch. What's going on with these plates? Can I have my veggie slider? Are we lunch is an overachiever? Well, if it, isn't that obvious? Um, I'm going to have her greet Jaya as well. Um, since she's here. This is one of Reese's friends. Um, she's hysterical. This could end badly. I've got emotional death turned off. That can't happen in my game. <laughs> mm -mm. No way. Um, Nude Lion, thank you for the tier one for four months. I'm so sorry I missed that one earlier. Thank you, thank you. <sighs> she, where okay someone give this girl her veggie slider i swear to god if he takes it babes just take your damn veggie slider and eat it eat your veggie slider do it sit and then come sit <laughs> they took her food and that's why she's feeling distance i don't blame her oh raylan's here actually the guy that she likes Oh God, Uncle Enzo wants to tell us the wildest story. Imagine Uncle Enzo calling you in the middle of your lunch break. What What could Uncle Enzo need to talk about in the middle of your lunch break, really? I, I wanna know now, I wanna know what Uncle Enzo's got to spill. Well, anyways, he's sitting here with his stone of friends, Demarcus. Um, let's go be friendly, uh, small talk. Wait, actually I need to turn language barriers off. You do not want to hear his stories. Oh, but I do though. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's sit here and talk to the guys a bit. And Beckham, let's get to know him too. Hmm, Demark. <laughs> Our safe reminder. Thank you very much. Let me go ahead and do that. It's okay. You're doing a lot of stuff here. Thank you. Um, thank you for uh, understanding as well. I hope Kayra is so the divorce papers finally. She was really taking her time with that though, right? Do we learn anything about Demarcus? He's a perfectionist. Nothing about pets though. I honestly, I might need to ask him about this, honestly. Might need to find out if he's actually a weirdo and whether we can actually be friends with him because might need to report him to the police. Imagine Enzo trying to be the cool uncle, the one who gives Reese the weed. Oh, actually, um, so they're supposed to have class now, but I was thinking that Reese could just bunk it. Um, and he actually has some weed. So I was just thinking, you know what I'm saying? That we could just go and grab these guys in a group with us and go sit at the back of the school. Um, because like, yeah, like we don't need to go to this class. So there is somewhere to sit over here. This looks like, this looks like the stone area. <laughs> okay, we're gonna bring Jaya to, actually no, Jaya, Jaya can stay. I'm just gonna bring boys. Um. Oh no, I don't think he has the smoking papers yet. Oh no, wait, do I need to buy him something? Oh, can we say that one of the other boys has it? Are you gonna go sit? Oh, you've gotta go sit too. You go sit with them. There you go. Thank you, Nora, for the tier one. Thank you, thank you. No, so, so, add me to the group. <laughs> Charlotte, Um, she wants to study for her exams and her lunch ends in 13 minutes. I thought she has another thing. Yes, yeah, she does, she has computer science. Well. She's a little goody two-shoes, so she's not going to miss it. 
Okay, it looks like Beckham's already here. We're skipping um, class. So, when you got to smoke but forgot papers and have to use an app. <laughs> right, okay. Can I just buy the papers and have him use them? Can I... Can I buy these papers? What are they called? Rolling papers? I'm about to buy these and place them on the table. <laughs> I mean, how the hell are you supposed to get them otherwise? I hope that if I place them on the table, he can use them though. Okay, let me look up roll and see if it'll let me do it. Uh, Babikina? Babikina? With the follow? Hopefully I didn't butcher that. Uh, okay, base mental rolling papers. Um, yeah, okay, I'm guessing that's what we want. Right, let's try them. Can he use them? <gasps> Roll joint. Hold on. Uh, we need Marcus, Beckham, and Reese to sit. And then roll a joint. <laughs> he can't roll the joint. Can he do it now? Yeah. Okay, you can do it. Wait, why is he dancing? Why is he dancing though? Why is he dancing to roll the joint? Did he roll it? <laughs> Okay, hold on. I need to pass. I need to pass the joints around <laughs> to everyone. Okay, right. You need a joint. Uh, I'm gonna give gift. Give a friendly gift. Of, here's this train wreck joint. Why is he dancing? He's not even high yet. He hasn't even started smoking. Guys, don't leave me. Don't you dare leave me. None of you leave me. You will sit. Right. Everyone, come sit. Beckham, Demarcus, Reese, sit. We're not going to class. <laughs> he's so happy. Is he okay? Oh, it's because he stinks. Well, make sure you shower next time. Right. Can we give it to... Let's give it to Beckham. Oh, control them. Good point. Let me take over. <laughs> right. Control, sim. Control. Right, you guys just stay. And then you need to give Beckham this join. Click on the join and then click share. It doesn't give an option, it just says to smoke it. No, there's no option on the join. Okay, friendly, give gift. Take this joint I just rolled, it's free. The next one you gotta pay for though. <laughs> They didn't want to get caught since Reese is acting suspicious. <laughs> okay, I'm getting him to give him this joint. It's literally in a box. Like, not suspicious at all. Not suspicious at all. <laughs> Nothing suspicious going on here. Oh my God. It wasn't a Valentine's Day present. It was just a present present. It's not a Valentine's Day present. Why are you acting like it is? You embarrassment. Stop. Oh. First, there was an odd warbing sound coming from the announcement speakers, and then a cacophony of very blatant flatulence noises, while those sounds are very immature and far beneath Charlotte. She can't help but smirk at the predicament, especially what the teacher's response. This could be the time to piggyback off the prank and become a legend among pranksters. Appreciate the prank on its own merit, or add personal sounds to the speaker. What would Charlotte do? Would Charlotte join in on the prank or would she just sit back and enjoy it? What do we think? She is a goody two shoes in the way where she'll make sure that she's always turned up to class. However, is she in it for a joke? Harder though. <laughs> would she join in or enjoy it? Oh, you guys are split. She'd just enjoy it. I think she'll enjoy it. Okay, I'll let her just sit back and enjoy it. Did you roll the next one? Yeah, he did. Okay, right then. Demarcus, uh, you can have this join. Um, give gift, and then take this join. There we go. I'm literally giving all these guys a join. Right, you can start smoking your one. Here you go. Here's your join. Enjoy, and then have him roll his. <laughs> he didn't do his little dancey dance. What do you mean, get ready for class? Class is very clearly over. Oh, the kids are not doing well today. 
Right, and then you smoke. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get them smoking. Here we go. This is what I'm saying. This is the Reese that we... <laughs> oh my God, look at him. He's gone. He is... Oh my God, look at them right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make sure that he doesn't smell like too bad. Because like, you know, I mean, maybe you can just say like someone comes over and says they smell something. Is he going off? Oh, he's going off. Okay, I'll just let him do his thing. It's the fact that they lean back though. It's so funny. Okay, so it's just him and um, it's just him and Demarcus. Um, spread rumor about a classmate. Oh God, no! Don't do that! Don't do that! Don't do that! I mean, <laughs> I kind of want him to. Okay, gossip about classmates. So Demarcus, you got, actually, yeah. So Demarcus, do you have any pets, by the way? Just needed to know. Um, hobbies. Pet? Animal? Nothing. I don't think I can ask him. <laughs> I was really gonna ask him. Maybe he can make a joke about it. Maybe he can joke about it. <laughs> I heard Beckham is in a gang. Like our Beckham? Like Beckham, our friend? I don't think he's in a gang. I mean, he's in our gang, but like, I don't think he's cool enough to be in a gang. <laughs> I mean, maybe, I don't know. Maybe outside of school, he's in a gang. <gasps> Demarcus has a major crush on Reese. There ain't no way. There, okay, hold on. Um, one thing that I didn't, that one thing that I didn't mention is Demarcus is actually pansexual and pan romantic. So, uh, he he kind of swings always. He has a crush on Reese. <laughs> you can't make this up. There is no way. I mean, I don't think that Reese would be interested, especially since he's got a thing for Tamia. So, <laughs> we love a pan king only if he doesn't like animals, like you like that you know what i'm saying um other, other than that yes pan king all the way but also if he likes animals then absolutely not um then we're not here for it <laughs> okay you go use the toilet um wait what's tamia doing wait is she trying to recruit people oh i want to i want to join the i want to join the cheer, cheer team go 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 excuse me i want to join the cheer team i want to join i want to join us to join go ask quick yeah, I was actually, can I come to tryouts? Because I'm not very good yet, but like, like I could do some practice and then like you could teach me. And then, wait, you should just go and let me in. Wait, do I get like bestie treatment? Do I get to just skip the tryouts? That would be great. Oh my God. I think she just skipped the tryouts. Oh, she did. She got to skip the tryouts because we're like friends with the, we're friends with the person who's in it. Well, that's useful. Oh, that's great. Thanks. We don't even have to try out. I mean, you didn't even know if I'm going to be bad. But anyways, um, I'm going to go and whisper about crush. Discuss why womp jocks are the best. Act's cool. I want to join. I don't want to join. <laughs> you can tell I'm totally not cool. <laughs> um, I'll give her a compliment. I'll give her props for letting us in. We're clearly the best. We're amazing athletes. We host the best parties and everyone loves us when we win. There's nothing not to love about being us. Okay, Charlotte, babe, you're being you're being a little much right now. Okay, babe, you're being a little. <laughs> Anyways, um, is there any cheer practice? Oh, there is. Speaking of, Demarcus is doing cheer practice. Well, I was actually thinking that um, cheer for Tamia. Yeah, why don't we go cheer for Tamia? Like, like I, I mean, it's not really a try. You're already in. But like, look what I can do though. Come, come watch me. She's gonna go try out and see what Tamia thinks of her. Wait, no, no, we're already gonna go over there. Here you go, try out. I, I bet she's gonna be so embarrassed. Literally, Charlotte has never cheered in her entire life. So this is just gonna be awful. It's gonna be so bad, I can already feel it. Oh my God, is that the, is that the principal? Oh no. Oh no, babes, put the pom-poms away. Put the pom-poms away, put the suit back on. Put the suit on. Oh my God, okay. Is Tamia on her way? 
Does she not want to see this? Honestly, wouldn't blame her. Okay. Is everyone ready for <laughs> Charlotte's first cheer session? It's going to be awful. Prepare yourselves. Tamia is literally upstairs. She's... Oh. Oh, it's not bad. Oh, okay. Oh, oh no, it's bad. Oh, no, it's bad. Okay, yes, queen. Spin. Spin. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Tammy didn't even want to come and watch. Don't really blame her, actually. Really don't. Really don't blame her for that. <laughs> no, it's really good. It was really good. She's so perfect. She really is. Okay, well, Reese is just walking around school, like, high as hell. Um, He's met this girl called Kirsten. Does he like her? He said hello to her. Anything, anything going on here? He thinks she's basic looking, but they actually do have good sentiments about each other. For once, Kirsten's like the only girl who hasn't like been felt that he's distant. So there might actually be a friendship going on here. I think he's talking about books. Wait, is he asking her if she wants to study with him? Can we go study together? Hold on. Yeah, she really is a natural, right? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna disband the group that we had. Um, well, we can just sit and talk to Kirsten a bit then. Um, deep thoughts. Let's go have a deep conversation. Hello. On her way to stardom. Well, she's about to piss herself on the way to the toilet. Yeah. Don't do that. that that's a way to be embarrassing. Um, who else have we got? Is anyone else, like, who's cool around the school? Anyone else? Mm. Oh, Tamia's upstairs. I think she was in the library. That's why she didn't come down to watch cheer. I think she was being a good egg. She was doing some homework. Wait, maybe she wants to do homework with us. Um, should I ask her if she wants to do some homework with us? Let me add her to the group. And then we'll go sit with her. Sit together. Come sit. She changes him later for the good. What finally gets him to not be unflirty. That would be nice. Oh, uh, she's left. Never mind. <laughs> right, anyways, I'm going to have Reese. Uh, is he still stoned? He's still got two hours until he's not stoned anymore. What do you do when you're stoned? Um, And your friends aren't around. Um, What's he going to do? Eat food? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But like, where am I going to send him to go eat? Paint? Oh, paint. Yes. Yes, this is good inspiration. Oh my God, yeah. Up in the artist studio. Okay, let's start something. Um, Let's do a large realism painting. Yeah, I was going to get him to eat, but like, there's not really much to eat here. So Charlotte's going to go upstairs and do our homework with Tamia. Oh yeah, Tamia's, Tamia's literally sitting up here with her. There you go. <laughs> we know too much on these. Have him paid Tamia. Oh no. <laughs> okay, I want them to do their homework. Um, so she hasn't started it yet. Let's have her do. Um, let's do. Mm -mm -mm. Scientific principles. Let's uh write English papers together. Who just? Pa oh, I was gonna say. What did I just get charged a hundred smolians for? It's because of his painting. No, Tamia! Where are they going? Are they going somewhere else to study? Why is she in here? Where's Tamia gone? Is Tamia going home? Why is she sitting down here? Okay, game, why do you do this to me? Like, there was a perfectly good seat to... Uh, sometimes this game really does bother me. <laughs> like, like, why can't you just do it upstairs? Oh, wait, her bestie's coming in to talk to her. Hi, Raylan. Or oh, Raylan. I keep calling... Oh, my God. I keep calling him by, his, like, by a name that's not actually his. Hi, Raylan. I'm just doing my homework. How are you? Um, affection? Okay, no. What do we What do? we do? Become best friends forever? Interests? Oh, ask how to be popular. That's the most unpopular thing ever. Ask him about his favorite passion. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> So for Valentine's Day, since I don't think Charlotte's going to have a Valentine's, 
Um, she does want to watch romantic TV. Um, do I ask him to come over and watch romantic? Wait, do I ask him to go to the cinema with us and watch romantic TV with us? Is that, that's a date though. That's a date. What about if I ask all of them to come? Like the whole group? Because then it's less of a date. You know what I'm saying? It's less. Because otherwise it's like too obvious. Oh my God. The the weed is, uh, it's giving some inspiration. It's giving potato. Potato. <laughs> How is he level six painting skill and painting stuff like that? Like I... <laughs> The weed is weeding. He really thinks this is his next masterpiece. Look at him. He's in his element. He's doing something good. Like, he's so proud. Nicely decorated. He's like, this is, this is going to be displayed. This is so good. He's so proud. Cannabis-induced euphoria. Feeling confident after creating a piece of art that will inspire the masses. <laughs> he's so delusional. He's so delusional. How is this? No. All right, we're taking it home. We're gonna take it home. <laughs> Literally cannot believe him. <gasps> he's so funny, honestly. <laughs> oh my God, he's going again. He's literally going again. See how much it costs. It's 291 smolians. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Inspire to riot. He's gonna go again. This better be a bit better than the last one. Actually, Delulu, like what? <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna have her finish up. Actually, we're not we're not gonna finish our homework tonight. We're just gonna go straight to the cinema. Um, okay, do I have them go to the rabbit hole cinema or do I have them go to the actual cinema that I've got installed? Like I've actually got a cinema that I can have them go to. She can't travel because she doesn't have an active subway pass. Purchase subway. Oh, they're gonna have to go off to get that. It's fine, I'll just use that done. <laughs> The actual one? Okay, so there's one in Oasis Springs, I think. Um, Yeah, the Lux Movie Theater. Okay, let's have them go there. And I'm gonna have her take everyone that's in the club with her. Um, Whoever can make it out of that group can come along to the cinema. Cause it's not an actual date, but also Valentine's Day and none of them are like together with anyone. So it's like not an actual date, but also it's like, you know, kind of a date. Like she's kind of imagining it's a date. <laughs> Um, Diogos, thank you so much for the follow. Tomcon, thank you for the follow as well. And Shakira as well, thank you so much. Oh, we're just like doing a club gathering here. Oh, okay, let's get changed. Cause I imagine she probably would have used her locker to get changed. So come and uh, get changed into, she was wearing, she was wearing this outfit this morning. So I'll have her wear the same one. Honestly, I love playing as a teen so much. Okay, perfect. Um, right, let's have everyone come and grab a serving of popcorn and let's go head in. What's his favorite color? We need to dye some hair. Oh my God, no. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> you might actually be onto something here. Oh, was there a save reminder? Thank you. Let me just go ahead and save now. Thank you, thank you. All right, we're gonna put on a nice um, romance mu music. Some, uh, sorry, m romance music, romance uh, movie. Sorry, I'm just gonna turn this off. She's gonna be so pissed. Um, right, watch movie. Um, what is a romance movie? Probably Roaring Vice. College Cram, Simda. Wait, maybe Simda? Simda, I think. Okay, let's try Simda with our popcorn. No, 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 we're not gonna eat our popcorn here. We're gonna go in. Eat our popcorn in there. It's the weed affecting us artistic. I'm not gonna have him go home, yeah? I am gonna have him keep painting while he's at school though. Oh, sorry. Why are these guys being actual cuties? Oh, no, no, everyone come sit together. Come sit guys. Oh, there we go. Wait, wait, Ra Raylan, come sit next to me. Damn it. Why is this old guy sitting on this? Oh my God. Raylan. No, no, we'll move We'll move back. We'll just move back a bit. It's fine. It's fine. Just move back. Just move back. Move back, guys. Move back. Move back. What is this? 
Gifts. Pay me like one of your French girls. <laughs> Can we move, please? I want to sit. <laughs> I want to sit next to him. It's supposed to be like a, a not date date. Please sit next to me. Like at least like there. He's crying into his bowl of popcorn. He's literally crying. Does she like it? I think she's enjoying it. Her and Tamia are literally like besties at this point. Honestly, her and Tamia are like the cutest friends ever already. They're so cute. Control him. Oh, you know what? I kind of forget I have that mod installed until someone reminds me. Okay, control. Bro, can you look, like just sit down? Sit. Sit. Yes. Yeah. I do have the steady seat mod, but it'll cancel them out of their... Is, did he just blow someone a kiss? Did someone just see him blow someone a kiss? Who did he blow a kiss? Because I don't think it was Charlotte. Who did he just blow a kiss to? Who? Who did he blow a kiss to, though? It better have been Charlotte, but I don't think it was. No one likes a know-it-all. That's what those nerd brains are. Okay, well, that's fine. We're not part of the nerd brains, so that doesn't matter. Can we talk about the movie? Movie. Argue about movies. No, no, that's not, that's not good. That's not good. Don't do that yet. <laughs> okay, what did we think? Did we, oh. Did that not count? Wait, did she enjoy it? Interesting flick. That movie was interesting. Worth the watch at least. Well, she did do this. I'm going to tick it off. Okay, now she's sitting back there. No, he's sitting next to Tamia. Okay, oh, Tamia, my babes. Yes. Yes, Tammy. Oh, she's come to sit next to her. <gasps> yes. Okay, anyways, he's just... <gasps> Wait. No, no, no. Wait, hold on. I think... No way. I think Regina and Ty are getting it on back here. Did you see them? I think he's got a crush on her. I think they're flirting with each other. <gasps> oh, no. Okay, anyways. Well, I want to be with this guy. <laughs> so, um, We need to... I, I don't want her to go in with any flirts just yet. I'm just going to have them like talk about their bucket list nothing suspicious here nothing suspicious and then we're just gonna get to know him some more there we go oh actually i do need to check when do the teens age up oh okay so the teens age up on monday next week which technically means they're gonna have their prom this weekend. So. Can Raylan ask her? I don't know about this. I don't know. Uh, Tinkubu, she needs to get a move on and flirt. Okay, I'll just go in with just like a little flirt. Just a little flirt. Just a, just a small flirt since it's Valentine's Day. Oh! <gasps> Wow, okay, it's literally... <laughs> Wowee, that sim is irresistible. Charlotte has a major crush on Raylan. Oh, wait, he's liking it. Wait, he's liking it. She actually does have a crush on him. I'm not even playing this up. Okay, yeah, she does like him. Why is he, like, in here, though, and, like, making it awkward? He's making it so awkward. And then I talk about football. That's so, like, not... That's so not hot. Like... <laughs> Okay, anyways, um, I'm just going to give him a bold pickup line. Yeah, yeah, Tamia, talk to, talk to Ty. Can you, like, can you just get him, like, out of this conversation? Because it's just awkward. Yeah, Ty, talk to Tamia. <laughs> Tamia, be my bestie right now. And just, like, like just talk to Ty right now, okay? I just need you to be my wingwoman. <laughs> so you just... You just, like, get him into the most engaging conversation that you've ever had, okay? We need a whole deep conversation going on here. Oh, my God. He flirted with her. No way. Okay, he flirted. He flirted with her. Okay, it's it's, it's good. It's good. Don't practice juggling. No, no, no. Oh, my God. He has a crush on her. Look. Did you see that? Yes. Okay, they've got a little bit of romance. They've got a little bit of romance. Okay, nothing crazy. Just, just more flirts. Just more flirts. Uh, just more flirts. Why is, is she doing this in front of him? She's trying to impress him. You're embarrassing yourself. Put it away. Oh no. 
Should I ask to get his number? <laughs> oh yeah, I'm just gonna get his number, but I'm gonna be like, oh, I'll just add you on Social Bunny. Like it was like nothing, you know, just so we can text. Like nothing, nothing weird, you know. Like would you, would you mind uh, if I could have your number? Tamia, you're supposed to be distracting him. Have a deep conversation with him. Oh, is that not an option for you? Okay, deep thoughts. Oh no, don't ask him about woohoo. Just like get him talking. Have some small talk. Ask him about what he does. We don't care. <gasps> Did he accept? Yeah, he accepted it. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Oh my God. Oh no. Oh no. The wing woman. The wing woman has developed feelings. <laughs> now she has a major crush on Ty. My wing woman is, is getting her own love life going on here. Okay, you know what? Keep going with it then. Keep going. Um, get, Talk about your hobbies with him. There you go. <laughs> Ty's actually in a love triangle with the other girl who's actually left uh, with Regina. So... <laughs> yeah, the crush system actually is so broken in the game. I need to I need to make sure that it like doesn't do it as often. I might get that mod so that crushes don't develop as often. As, as soon as you talk to another teen, it's like, okay, they've got a crush on each other now, you know? <gasps> She's going to go flirt again. Wait, are they watching? Columsi sisters? Okay. He's going to the toilet. Oh my God, no. <laughs> Not Regina coming back. Oh, Regina. So uh, anyways, let me just get to know her. I'm gonna get her away. Oh no, imagine she's gonna start fighting with Tamiya over their crush. No, because they both like Ty. Well, what are we supposed to do about this? She learned that she's an extrovert. Well, we need to like distract Regina. I need to be the wing woman now. It's only fair. Okay, gossip. Yeah, gossip a little bit. And then Tamia, you get Ty, okay? You get Ty. Give him a little flirt, but just don't make it obvious. Just a little flirt. Little flirt. Just don't look, babes. Just don't look. <laughs> it's so high score, it really is. Oh no, why is she feeling awkward? Although, hold on, what are, the, what, what are these? Why does she feel dizzy? Oh no, she got bonked on the head by a soccer ball. Hold on, what else does she have? Romantic atmosphere. Um, like Sim nearby. Okay, so she's having a good time. Well, it is like literally one o'clock in the morning. We need to go home like right now. Anyways, thanks guys for coming. Uh, I'm gonna go home now. Otherwise I'm actually gonna get like kicked by my mom and dad. So I'm just gonna go. So anyways, thanks for being here guys. Oh, how I love joy of life. <laughs> Regina can have the emo kid. Who's the emo kid? Wait, hold on. Who's the emo kid? Is that the one who likes the animals? Is it the weird one? <laughs> Honestly, the perky walk, like being so happy. She really is. Oh, actually, now that we've added um, him, I'm going to add him on social bunny. So tag. Oh, ta should I tag him? No, no, no. I want to friends. I want to add him to my contacts. In fact, let me just add everyone on the contacts. Um, so Tamia, uh, Regina, and Ty. Um, who else is in the popular group? Uh, I think that was it. I think that might have been it. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm going to tag him, Raylan, in a... Um in a flirty message. Okay, what did she say? If you were a vegetable, you'd be a cute cumber. Anyways. <laughs> she needs a bit of help. <laughs> Hi, wifey. I'm new, I found you from YouTube. You helped me so much to put reshade in my game. Oh, I'm glad, I'm glad it was helpful. It was so bad. It was so bad. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not supporting that one. <laughs> it was horrible. <laughs> he, she called him a cute cumber. <laughs> like what? <laughs> so embarrassing. Okay. Neat feels better. That's great. Um, she brought home her homework. One thing that I do want to do is I want to have Neve set up. I thought she was feeling better though. 
No. I want to set up a curfew. And I want to make sure that the kids are home by... Okay, guys. What time should I do the curfew for? Because the curfew does actually set for everyone. Like, seven... Maybe, like, nine... Should we have the kids back by nine? 11? I feel like Neve would say nine. I feel like she would say nine. Let's do nine. Okay, anyways, one thing that I do want to do is uh, I kind of want to imagine that Emiliano has been out. Like, you know, like we're going to go out with him now, but just imagine that he was already out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to go send him out. But he was already out, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, hopefully this is making sense. Um, I want him to go to the local lounge and I'm just gonna have him go there and drink. It's gonna be really sad. He's just gonna go there, drink a bit. Um, yeah, he's just, he's dealing with his grief of losing his parents and he's gonna deal with that in uh, not the best way, but it is something that will help him hopefully feel better. It will numb the pain a little bit. Have Enzo join him? No, 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 no. That's a step too far. Maybe at some point Enzo can join, but I'm not inviting him there, okay? Like, it just, if he's there, he's there, okay? <laughs> and, okay, let's go to the bar at the back and um, let's go order. What should we have him order? Something strong, probably. What do you guys think that um, Emiliano would drink? What do you think? Does he drink glass of Hennessy? We've got Jack Daniels. We've got rum. Uh, margaritas. Um, you kind of see whiskey. I kind of see him drinking whiskey too. Gin fizz, wine, wine, mimosas. Jack Daniels. Martinis. Martini. Vodka. Oh, he's a whiskey guy. Okay, where was the whiskey? Glass of wine. Whiskey. Okay, let me have him get the whiskey. Just straight vodka. <laughs> okay, it's not, it's not that bad. He's not quite there yet. Oh, he's so sad. Look at him. Oh, this is like the worst Valentine's Day too. Excuse me, where's your whiskey? Oh my God, the bartender's changing out. Can you like get back and do your job? Because like, I just want to drink, please. Is he going to go cry? Oh, he's going to try and give himself a pep talk. No, that's sad. Don't do that. Just wait until, wait until he starts working again. He'll be back in a second. <laughs> um, Scott, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome back. Welcome in. Sorry, welcome back. <laughs> welcome in. Um, okay, order drink. Order. Grab your... Why is he going again? Oh my God. I'm going to have to have him make his own drink at this point. Okay, just buy buy a beer or something. What is this? Power drink? I'm just going to have him buy a beer, guys, just because um, he's not getting... <laughs> he's not getting a drink, apparently. Unless he goes to make his own one. Drunk on Valentine's? Poor Neve. I feel like if he comes home drunk on Valentine's, Neve's going to have a problem. And honestly, I'd, I wouldn't blame her for that. I feel like it's very justified being pissed off if he comes home at like three o'clock in the morning drunk on Valentine's Day. Like, you know. All right, go drink your beer. There you go. Well, this is just really sad and lonely, especially with these people dancing in the background. Is that Tommy? Hold on. <laughs> I did not see who that was back here. Not Tommy. Not our brother, the our brother's mistress. <laughs> Who's like no longer interested in him, but like also, what is she wearing? I definitely never gave her this outfit. And what's this guy doing? Oh my god. Get her to talk to him. Do you think she'd come over? Oh wait, this is actually helping. Look! His sad mood looks are going down when he um when he drinks, his sad mood looks go down. That's pretty good. Okay, he needs to go pink. Uh <laughs> he needs to go pink? He needs to go pee. What? Okay, this guy's actually just rocking it right now. <laughs> Numbing the pain. Clearly it is. Clearly it is. I mean, I don't want to be like a negative Nancy, but it is working. Um, I'm going to have him order um, that whiskey that we were trying to order earlier. And then I'm going to have him... Um, 
That'll be his last drink and he'll go home. Poor guy, I know, I know. He is already, oh, he's already wasted. He's wrecked and utterly wasted. Although he did like that drink. Oh, he's angry. That's it. Emiliano's had enough of that nagging feeling. Telling him to do this or do that. Either he gets his way or nothing at all. What does he want to do? He wants to meet someone new at a lounge. He wants to meet someone new here. Okay, well, say hello to this guy then. Exchange secrets? I mean, can we just go, can we just say hello first? Emiliano, you know what will make you feel better? Therapy. <laughs> Actually, actually, can I have him go share his secrets? I kind of want him to share secrets. Anyways, share melancholy thoughts. Yeah, okay, let's just tell him about our sad thoughts. They are men straight to the secret. Where is he going? Bro, where are you going? Who's this? <laughs> What's going on? Why did we have to go all the way up here? Oh my God, is he coming up here? Why have we got to share the secret in the library? <laughs> is it really that big of a secret that we can't say in the bar? We've got to go to the library in front of Mary, the librarian. <laughs> is she our therapist? <laughs> like what is actually going on here? Who's this? This guy is kind of good looking though. No, 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 no. Okay, he's drunk. Emiliano, you're drunk. Baby fever, it's everywhere. And even Emiliano is coming down with it. While it would be a huge change for him, he just feels like it's the right time. And that time is right now, isn't it? Should Emiliano have a baby? No. No, he shouldn't. No, no, no. That's not how you deal with this loneliness. You don't go and have another baby because you're lonely. No, that's not the way it works. That's not, no, 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 no. Okay, by the way, guys, that that um thing that came up. Okay, also he has a moodlet about it. You can see in here. He's coming down with just a wee bit of baby fever and considering having a baby. Um, This comes with the errant thoughts mod. I think errant, errant thoughts mod. Also, hold on, hold on. This is the neighborhood uh, drug dealer. <laughs> Sorry, can we just talk about the neighborhood drug dealer in the library right now? Probably selling his weed. Anyways, um, <laughs> yeah, this mod comes with the errant thought mod is by AD Pindigo and it will make your Sims like have random thoughts throughout their life of like something that you might want to have. And depending on if you follow it through and do it or you don't do it can like impact the way that they'll feel about it, which I think is actually really cool. Yeah, honestly, this guy's being so not conspicuous at all. I love the fact that he looks so shady in the hood too. Love that. Okay, well, anyways, Emiliano is going home about five o'clock in the morning, completely wasted. The sunset, or the sunrise, sorry, is looking beautiful. It's already about stuck coming up. But he's going home and is about to be killed. You know, he's browsing the dark web. He's doing it just so he didn't have to do it at home. <laughs> Let's make a baby. No, 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 <laughs> no. No, no, it's not happening, okay? <laughs> uh, Kalia, thank you for the follow. Sorry, I missed that a second ago. Thank you so much for the follow, welcome in. <laughs> That's iRobot at work. <laughs> can we go to school with our little uh, Air Ginny? Yes, we can, we can go tomorrow. They can go to school. Um, okay, so technically speaking, everyone should have been in bed. I'm just going to go ahead and like, because we wasn't actually here playing with them, they really should have been in bed. So I'm just going to like cheat their sleeps up um, and actually put them in bed just so that it makes more sense. Um, so you was in bed. Ginny, you would have been in bed too. Uh, Neve probably wouldn't have been in bed. Neve probably would have been up stressing because Emiliano isn't home yet. Um, oh my god, is he about to puke? Uh, yuck! And then he's about to go make a berry waffle. No, 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 no. Oh my god, he's passed out at the front. Oh my god, he's passed out at the front. No, 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 no. Okay, Neva's really about to go wake him up. 
That's it. That's it. Right on the front lawn. Like, who does he think he is? You embarrassment. You've been out. Look, wake up, Emiliano. Wake up. Look at her. She's feeling like, she's feeling terrible. She said, Neva has a horrible feeling that the love of her life is on something. He won't even wake up. He's so out of it right now. Can you please wake up? Can you please wake up? Can you please wake up? <laughs> like, why is he not waking up? Honestly, he needs an intervention. Right, you know what? I'm just gonna go. I was trying to think, does she handle it well? Does she, is she mad? Is she mad? Or does she handle it well? Sorry, I'll do the save reminder while you guys decide. Is she mad or does she handle it well? I mean, understandably, she she should be mad. But... Yeah, I mean... She's mad, but she handles it well. Okay, I'm gonna go. And I'm gonna make her mad, okay? So I'm gonna give her the thing. Hold on. Cheat. Mod. Uh, cheat. I'm gonna make her angry. She's just gonna be, she's just gonna be angry. Just, just an angry, you know, just a base anger. There we go. Okay, just a little bit angry. Yeah, she'd be more worried. And then I think she's gonna go and um, can we ask him what's wrong? Um, friendly. Hmm, what can we do? Complain? Deep thought. Accuse of being drunk. Okay, we're well, taking this in deep thoughts. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna have her ask. Are you drunk? Have you been out all night drinking? Is that where you've been? Uh -huh. Oh, she gave him a kiss on the cheek though. She's handling it so well at like literally six o'clock in the morning. She's been up. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, she really hit him with the ultimatum already. Oh no. Okay, I love you, and it's really tearing me apart seeing you like this. Can you please stop doing, like, can you please stop drinking? Can you please stop doing drugs? Can you please stop drinking? Does he tell the truth that he's been drinking? And does he say he's going to stop drinking? Or does he lie? I would say he's going to lie. For now, at least. I would say just for now, he's going to lie. Because I don't think he has any intent of actually stopping drinking. If he if he tells the truth, that means he has intentions of stopping drinking. I don't I don't think the question is, have you been drinking? I think the question is, can you please stop drinking? Like, can you please stop drinking in the future? So I think if he goes and says, Yeah, I'll stop drinking in the future, or he can go and say, yeah, I'll stop drinking, but he has no intentions to. Do you know what I mean? I don't think it's actually, have you just, have you been out drinking? I mean, yeah, she did find him passed out. Okay, I'm just going to have him tell the truth. Let me see what that says. Aww. Aww. Okay, I failed you. I'm so sorry. I know it might not mean much yet, but I promise you I will get better. Oh. Oh, stop. Oh, no. And then she is has a peace of mind. Knowing that someone you love has promised to get better and clean up their act really puts you in a good mood. Okay, that's good. That's really good. Although being called out on your apparent substance intake and promising that you'll clean up your act to people you care about is enough to make anyone uncomfortable. Oh, God, he feels uncomfortable about it. Okay, I'm going to have him go up to bed then and just go straight into bed because he's, like, clearly not very well. And um, I think she's going to go back to bed now that she knows that he's, like, you know, safe and secure. Um, and get a little bit more sleep before she goes to the bakery today. I know, the random pet bath. It's because I need to keep out to go give uh, Queenie a wash. I don't think he's a drunk. He's just been drinking. No, I don't think he's a drunk in general. I just think he's been drinking and he is drunk. But I don't think he he is a drunk. Like he's like he's not like a um. He doesn't have a drinking problem yet. He's just trying to cope with his grief, you know. However, he is very drunk. Like 
He's just, yeah, he's out of it. <laughs> Let's go put him off to bed. Oh, does she get out of bed? Oh, Reese's class is going uh, to a field trip. Cool. Why did she get out of bed? Um, Is she still not feeling great? It says she's on the mend. It's definitely on the mend. She's heading in the right direction. Okay, so she is feeling better than before. Oh, what's Reese doing? Reese has got the munchies from the weed that he had last night. Uh, okay, Reese, go grab yourself some yummy breakfast then. In fact, actually, should we have Neve go prepare a breakfast? I'll have her go do it. Breakfast. Let's do a really yummy breakfast since he said, Mum, I'm really hungry. She doesn't need to go to the hospital. She's um she's okay. It says she is on the mend, so she's actually feeling a lot better. Um, I'm gonna have her go make strawberry pancakes for everyone. <laughs> Are you for real? Wasted? I'm so mad at you right now. Wait, no! Oh my god, does she does he have red eyes? There's no way she know Oh my god, Annie's about to go on for this field trip. <laughs> Uh, that's so funny. No, that's so funny. And now he's leaving. Oh my God, he's still stoned. Oh my God, it's so obvious. And look at her. She is so done. She is so done. She's like, what is going on with my family? Like my husband comes home, passed out drunk. My son is high. Like this is a horrible day for Neve. I feel so awful. She is livid at her child for doing drugs oh my god okay well you're not getting them pancakes anymore <laughs> he's like bye mom i'm going off on my field trip now bye bye <laughs> he just walks out and that's oh she is pierced oh she is you need to go take a bubble bath take a calming bubble bath okay take a bath with soaks i need some muscle relaxing <laughs> soaks she needs all the the like calming sensations and smells right now she needs a candle burning in fact, you know what? I'm gonna light that candle right now. We're gonna we're gonna turn off all the lights. We're gonna light this candle. We're gonna turn off the lights in the bathroom. There we go. Turn off this room. We're just gonna sit with our candle on in the bath. <laughs> Is this amazing house up for download? Not yet. Not until I'm done with the series. Um, it will be done when I'm done. Oh, we're going to school with the kids today, aren't we? Oh, yay. Neve no longer feels sick. Okay, great. She was feeling a bit under the weather. Okay, kiddos. Um, They've got to go to school in a second. Um, Would the kids have done their homework? See, we was out all night, so I couldn't do... Like, I couldn't get the kids to do their homework. Would they have done it, though? She has a different mood. Let's say she needs to go to the hospital. No, she's good. She's good. She's just angry and she's angry. <laughs> oh, Naomi, thank you so much for the gifted sub, Tanessa. Thank you, thank you. Guys, can we get some love in the chat for Naomi with the gifted sub, please? Graham would at least. Okay, select who you're going to go with. So for this one, I'm going to send all students alone because this is high school. And then elementary school, I'm going with both of the kids. Let's go. Homework has been done, I feel like. I feel like the kids would have done their homework. I'm gonna I'm gonna cheat it only because we was out all day playing with Charlotte, so it's not fair. <gasps> Naomi with another gifted sub, baby, you're so so generous. Oh, excuse me, thank you so much. <laughs> um, are you gonna add more Sims from the hashtag MLS Townies? I might do, but right now I've already added like maybe like fifteen or so, so I've already added a lot, so I don't really want to add any more right now. Okay. Here we are, we're at school, here we go. So here are some of Ginger's friends. <gasps> okay, so here is Dominique, who I said I want her to be her bestie at some point. We've also got um, Dolce here. We've got Philip, who is actually um, her mum's best friend's son, who I, she probably should have already known. Uh, and we've also got her other friend, Christopher, as well. Oh no, but Graham's friend isn't here though. Unless she's already inside. I don't think she's here. Uh, let me just check. Kiara? Oh no, she's here. Oh, she's upstairs. Yay, his friend's here. Okay, go talk to Kiara. Um, Talk about philosophy. Honestly, he's a bit of a weird kid. Go. <laughs> okay, this is, uh, this is Philip. 
Let's um discuss personal belief. No, tell make believe story. Philip's haircut is clean. It really is though, isn't it? That's a super super good haircut. Okay, you go use the toilet though. Ah, thank you, Bella. I'm glad you like my game. I spent a lot of time perfecting the aesthetic of my game and getting all my Sims ready and stuff. So. Ah, look at him and his friend Kiara. So cute. Speculate about other Sims. Yes, drama. I love his Spider-Man jumper. Are you gonna go use the toilet? Yeah, she is. Okay, so we've got a bit of morning free time with the kids and then we need to play with their toys at the toy box. You go use the toilet and then play with toys. Yeah, find something to play with. He looks uncomfortable. Wait, what's wrong with Graham? He, oh, he has his loose tooth. He does need to attend his class. Wait, quick. Uh, environment and culture class. Okay, you need to go to attend your class too. Philip's top is cute. Oh, I'm not gonna know where his top's from. Not for kids CC. I know for adults, but not off the top of my head for kids CC. Sorry, I'm not, I'm not that good with nine creators. Not for, not for kids. Most of the time they're like conversions of adults CC. Graham's friend looked like she was forced into being friends. No, I swear. They are friends. Where is she? <laughs> Where is she? Where's his friend? Is she coming? Yeah, she's coming. Oh, Dominique's sitting next to uh, sitting next to Graham as well. Oh, she's sitting at the back. Damn. Friends. Stop. They are friends. I swear. <laughs> okay, how's the uh, environment class going? Hi, Nat. Welcome back. What did I miss? Um, in the previous day, we went to school. Oh my God, Charlotte's acne. Oh, wow. Something's not right. She has quite a horrible feeling with one of her guardians. Oh, she knows her dad's drunk. Um, she woke up with loads of acne. Oh, she is gonna lose it. She's gotta go to school with loads of acne. Oh no. Um, I'm gonna have Charlotte make sure that she um, actively participates in uh, school today. The friends sitting far away. I know she's really not helping this whole, like, I swear, guys, they're really close friends. And, like, literally, why is she sitting so far away? Like, why is she ruining this for me? <laughs> oh, he wants to meet Anton. Who's Anton? This kid. Oh, my God. Wait, he wants to be friends with Anton. Predict results of upcoming championship game. Hold on. Is that, like, a, is that like a gaming thing? I think that's, like, a gaming thing. Okay, well, he needs to socialize with anyone. Advantage benefits of health food. Why is Graham such a little nerd? Like, honestly, I love this kid so much, but he's such a nerd. Like, he really is. He's such a nerd. Oh, I love him. Anyways, Ginger, you go talk to Dominique because she's like literally the cutest thing ever. Converse about, you know, that's too much for a kid. Converse about societal issues. Educate about, mi no, 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 no. Okay, small talk. Oh, wait, hold on. I need to, uh, I need to set the kids up to make sure that they've got no language barriers. I need to install that, uh, uninstall that mod, sorry, after, after the stream. There we go. Now they should be able to just talk away. What else does she want to do? Level up in her mental skill and collect a new metal. Why is she saying like she doesn't like me? Okay, now we're friends. Okay, yeah. Changed up real quick, right? Changed up real quick. Have we got any hobbies in common? Anything? What are we going to go do? Oh, we're going to go lunch. Wait, what's she saying? She's asking a question about going on a plane. Well, can we just go grab some lunch? Oh my God, all the kids are grabbing lunch. Okay, go grab a hamburger slider. Graham, are you grabbing lunch? Do you know who's going to be Gen 2? Yes, our Gen 2 heir is this little, this little girl over here. Her name's Ginger. She's going to be our... Uh, are they stuck? I think it's because Dominique's in the way. Babes, can you like move back? I think she's like literally blocking them. Can you move over here? You're blocking us in, Dominique. Right, can you go? What is blocking her? How comes they could walk in, but they can't walk out? I'm so confused. Right, what is, 
uh, would that be better? There. That should mean that you can get past now. Like, uh, sometimes this game really does confuse me. You got in there. What do you mean you can't get back out? Okay, now she can move. Okay. Anyways, go grab your fried chicken slider. <laughs> night, night, TT. We'll speak to you later. Thank you for joining. Okay, so in order for um, Ginger to do well at school, she needs to study gardening online, play with her toys, and socialize with animals. Wait, can we go play with the animals? There's animals outside. There's chickens. Spawn chicken. Spawn chicken. Spawn chicken. Let me just spawn a whole lot of chickens. There we go. And then can we go play with the chickens? I want to do that. It's 10 to midnight here. The school run is going to be a struggle tomorrow, Sarah. The commitment to being here. I appreciate it. If you got to go, you got to go, though. Dominique, why don't you come grab some food, too? Oh, I can't control her. Sorry, I'll just come out of you. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Why are you guys so funny? I heard Demarcus. Oh, no. Did you grab your food in the end? Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna hop in the shower real quick, but I'm still uh, gonna have the live going. No worries, Nessa. Thank you for thank you for letting me know. Um, just grab just grab whoever foods this is because I doubt you're ever gonna get some food otherwise. There you go. Graham's using the toilet. Graham needs to study Salvadorian culture online. Okay, there are computers upstairs. I think there's a PC room. Didn't I? I swear I turned this into a PC room. Hmm. Maybe I didn't. Maybe that was in my other series. Yeah, that must have been in Whimsy. Um, okay, let me uh, change this out and get some computers for the kids to work on. Otherwise, they can't do any like studying. I'll just buy the cheapo ones. There you go. That should be enough computers. Now that Reese's crush likes someone else, who do you think he's going to go to prom with? Oh, I don't know. I, I didn't I didn't think about this. Um Okay, we need to Salvadorian culture online. Okay, and are you playing with the animals? You haven't even socialized with the animals yet. Where's the chickens? Come call the chickens out. Oh my god, there's an evil hen in there. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna save the game right now because I swear to god, if my kid dies. If my Gen 2 air dies by being killed by a killer chicken, I will actually lose my mind. You know what? I'm not even going to call that chicken out. That's, uh, that's actually frightening my life. Right, just just don't call the evil hens out. Only the nice hens. <laughs> I only want the nice hens. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, did his friend just take... You've got to be kidding me. Right, go talk to these chickens. Excuse me, chickens. Oh, the school I work at has chickens too. Oh, I love that. That's so cute. Where are the chickens though? They're not coming out. Is there not enough room for them? Are you using a mod to make the school different and go with children? Yes. Yeah, it's called the Ghost of School mod by Zerbu. Okay, I'm just going to say she socialized with the animals because honestly... The animals aren't coming out. Like, the animals don't want to come out today. Oh, wow. <gasps> Charlotte's now working in an A grade. She's so good. Um, Ginger and Graham both did pretty good in school today. Oh, my God. Ginger worked up towards a B. Oh, good job, girl. Yeah, she's now at a B. Oh, she's doing so well. Good job. Look at all those chickens. Wait, I think my game's just frozen. Hello? Is it because I saved in the middle of it doing something? Not a good sign. <laughs> Graham is 100% Sheldon vibes. Okay, Graham, I think he, yeah, he was done with school. Wait, he's talking to Anton. He said he wanted to become friends with Anton. I want Anton to be his new friend. There he is. Oh, he's leaving. <laughs> I want Anton to be his new friend, he says, as he walks away. Can you just go and run and talk to him a second? I don't think Anton wants to be your friend. Okay, anyways, let's just go home. <laughs> the way I missed a, a two whole hours, I can't wait to watch the stream back though. Okay, good. I'm glad you like it. I'm glad you're excited to watch it. Uh, ooh, okay. Be tricky. Um, be defensive, be aggressive. 
Um, I'm going to have her be aggressive. I kind of get aggressive vibes from Charlotte. I can I can imagine some aggress aggressive pom-pom throws. You know what I'm saying? Some aggressive turns and jumps, flips, <laughs> backflips. Honestly, I'm not, I don't even play this up. Graham is such a loner and like, like he's just actually a loner. Like I'm not even choosing it. No one, I, okay, I don't want to be mean. No one likes Graham. Every friend that I've tried to get him to talk to, no one's interested. It just doesn't go well. Like I am trying hard to get this kid, like even just one friend, but that one friend doesn't even want to be his friend. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> I'm trying out here. His trait is that he's a geek. He has no other traits that would impact him being friends with anyone. He's just a geek. Oh my God, Naomi, I'm so sorry. I, I missed that you gifted another sub. Thank you so much. And also uh, Megan and Sarah with the follow. Thank you guys so much. Um, I'm so sorry. If we could get some gifting berries in the chat for Naomi. I don't get it. I don't get why people want, don't want to be friends with him. Like he seems really sweet. I just don't get it. Oh my God. Oh no, slight depression. Neve is slightly depressed after finding out her kid is doing drugs. Oh no, and now Reese is like sat up in his room. He's not even going to come down. <laughs> There's no way he's going to look his mum in the eye after this. Oh my god. Okay, well, Emiliano's woken up. Woken up. Um, I'm going to get rid of the wasted because there's no way he'd still be wasted the next day. Um, okay, let's get him up. He's, he's literally slept the whole day, so I'm just going to give him his energy back. Maybe that's where he becomes... A oh, actually, you know what would be good for him? Oh, wait, is he going to come up and talk to his brother? Oh, his brother's like the only person who actually understands him. That's kind of sweet in a way. Ginger's just sitting down here and watching some some stuff. Oh, maybe we could have... Uh, maybe Ginger can... Well, first of all, come in here and come and take a quick shower. But maybe we could say... Uh, we Neve's crying in her bed. Maybe we could go and grab her mum. And say, like, mom, do you want to, like, come, you know, make some cookies with me or something, you know? Like, I imagine in a cute way that's, like, Ginger's offer of trying to cheer her mom up. You know, she knows she's sad. So, like, look at her walking around with her head down. That's so unlike Neve. Um, I'm going to have her come upstairs. And I'm going to have her try to be affectionate with her. And um, let's go and give her a hug since we know she's sad. I feel you need parenting is hard. <laughs> His brother isn't understanding. He is just high. Well, he's not high right now. Okay, there's no way he'd still be high. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting rid of that. Oh no, why is she still? Why is she in here again? Oh no, bothered by wind. Wind can be so bothered. Oh, she doesn't like the wind. Oh, okay. Ginger, come upstairs. Come and give your mum a hug. Right, hold on. I'm gonna get them like in a room. Um, add to group and then go here with your mum. The whole family needs to go to family therapy. I completely agree. All right, really quick. I know Ginger, she's very perceptive when it comes to family's feelings, I feel like. Yeah, like she literally knows she can mock her sadness. Um, instead, I'm gonna have her do something nice and I'm gonna have her give her a little hug. And then um, we're going to suggest maybe if she wants to, like, go make cookies or something. Um, I think that'll be nice for them. Oh, Aww, look. So cute. And Charlotte's back from cheerleading. Oh, she felt instantly happy after that. She was feeling really sad. And now she's giving her a hug. She feels so much better. Oh, so cute. Okay, let's go and uh, cook together. <clears throat> we're going to do it by category. We're going to do... Um, actually, would it be in here? Maybe it'd be through this. Um, I want to cook together. I just want to make dessert. Oh, there you go. Desserts. Um, I was thinking cookies with ginger. Yes. Uh, what cookies should we make? Ooh. Uh, Riccarelli, chocolate chip cookies, fl flirty heart, black and white. Almond macaroons. I feel like we should just do classic chocolate chips. Your baby's hugs are genuinely that magical, yeah? <laughs> it's cute. What's Reese doing out here? Why is my game breaking again? Is it because I made them cook together? Oh no, it's probably the last exception report that happened earlier. It's probably like finished generating it. 
Hold on, guys. Give my game a second. It's because earlier it like bugged out, so now it's generating that last exception. We just give it a sec. <laughs> I love macaroons. Macaroons like my favorite thing. Okay, like, are we gonna just gonna wait like five thousand years? Anyways, <laughs> what's everyone doing? <laughs> Yeah, I love my creams too. She can mock her sadness. What a good ale. <laughs> yeah. Um, Theo, 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 Theoxy with the follow. Thank you so much for the follow. Okay, guys, I'm getting a little concerned now. Why is this taking so long? Do I save the game? I'm just going to save the game so nothing happens. We don't lose anything. I really shouldn't have saved the game. This was like my worst idea ever. Oh my God. <laughs> patience is key you think it's probably another last exception it might be oh hold on it worked i think it must have generated it yeah it was it says something about sim realist oh okay anyways we're back okay can we go cook together now <clears throat> Are they going to go bake? No, no, we're not talking to Reese. No, no, we're not talking to you, Reese. Okay, we're not. We're going to go cook. Down here. Ah, she's calling Ginger over. That's so cute. Go bake with your mum. All right, we're baking the chocolate chip cookies. Ginger is on her way. Come help. Come on, then. don't just stand there. I want to see you actually mixing something. Did she mix anything? She didn't mix anything. She's just watching. <laughs> She's literally just watching. I feel like Reese is trying to get on his mom's good side by coming down here and talking to his mom, though. Like, trying to act like, oh, you didn't just find me high earlier, mom, by the way. Um, I still feel like she would hold a little bit of a grudge. I'm not going to lie. I can still see her being a little bit angry. Sorry, where, where are the chocolate chips? What are you doing putting them up there? Hello? Okay, anyways. <laughs> right, let's have um let's have Ginny uh go eat a serving together. Reese is like, so how are you doing, Mum? Yeah, I feel like he's just trying to be like not awkward at all. Oh my god, feeling awkward. He's finding it difficult. No, he's really finding it awkward being around a sim he had a difficult conversation with and he feels really embarrassed. Oh my god, he actually does feel embarrassed. <laughs> Should I have him try and apologize? Discuss health. Um, okay, I'm wondering if he could apologize. Uh, deep thoughts. Apologize for using drugs. I mean, he's not going to stop, but like, yes, he's going to apologize. Oh, <laughs> I'm just going to be like, look, mom, I'm really sorry. It won't happen again. How did that go? I'm so sorry. I promise I won't do that again. And she accepted it. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's apologizing for getting caught. <gasps> Actually, guys, a decent bit of artwork from Reese. I'm not gonna lie, quite impressed with this one. I mean, it's certainly better than than this one. <laughs> Please. <laughs> this one's actually not that bad. Okay, let's go make another one. Um, let's do a confident one. The skills. He's so funny, honestly. Um, Charlotte is back doing her workout again. This girl is always working out. I, I respect it. I really do. Working on her fitness skill. You're not even in your athletic wear, though. There you go. Uh, Ginger, she just she just ate the cookie that she made. Cute. Ah, And she's doing good at school, too. The potato head needs to burn. The potato head's pretty bad, to be honest. Uh, oh, Emiliano's still feeling really sad. And he does want to have a drink. Oh, God. He wants to have a drink. I kind of want to send him to the bar. Again. Like, is it too bad to go, like, the next... <laughs> should I have him go? I don't know if I should have him go. He wants... He said he wants to. Like, should I not give the man what he wants? I'm going to have him go ask Neva about her day because he also wants to do that too. Ask 
about us day maybe let me just type in day ask about day what a red flag he says he wants to no no this game doesn't understand how does neve have baby fever no do you understand that you're like both over 50 like you're both 50 years old you can't have another child like you can have a grandbaby in like like five ten years maybe like oh my god now he wants to try for a baby with neve like what are you doing they're crazy guys i can't like i, I actually can't deal with them i can't The fact that he's listening to like calming music while painting this thing as well. <laughs> like I, actually the baby band, yeah, the baby bandage, like as if it's gonna fix all the problems in the relationship by having a baby. No, can we instead make a rational decision and sit and watch the game of llamas together, the premiere? Can we just all sit down and watch this together? Kids too, let's have a family watching night, okay? Let's just all come and watch it other than Reese. And Charlotte, because she's doing her exercises. <laughs> and Reese is outside doing his spray paints. Can they spontaneously try for a baby? I mean, they can. I mean, technically, they can autonomously do it, and I'll have, like, no choice if they do, so... Hopefully, they don't. <laughs> Aw, look at them. I'm in a little family night watching this TV premiere. This is cute. Did they forget Neve is infertile? Like, if they do want to have a baby, they're going to have to go through IVF, most likely. Oh, Graham likes deception. Does he really? <gasps> Am I seeing a little, little red streak in Graham here? Interesting. How's the spray paint going, Reese? Nice. Okay, you've got a nice base going. Our giddy two shoes is turning into Satan's spawn. No, no, no. He's not as bad as Enzo. He's not as bad as Enzo. Hi, Poonie Cat. Do you have a list of CCs? I have loads of CC videos on my YouTube channel if you want to check them out. She's 50. Yes, Neve is 50. Like, look at her age, right? Okay, so my ages in the game, my adults are 35 to um, 60. So technically 59. Like, Elder is, Elder is 60. So if you see how far away she is, she's got 10 days till she ages up. She's technically, like, 52 so, like, she's pretty old, you know? Like, I mean, she's pretty close to her elder age, you know? 52. Why do these kids hate Neve? Smoking, being deceptive. Who's next? Like, it's just, oh. It's just, yeah, it's bad. It's bad. I have to choose between a gaming laptop and another dog for Christmas. I want both, though. Oh, no. That is a hard decision. If it was me, do you already have a laptop? If it was me and you already have a laptop, then I would just choose the dog. But if you don't already have a laptop, then maybe you could get a dog next year. Oh, what's wrong, Queenie? Baby, what's up? Let's play with her. The kids are being kids, yeah. Oh, Charlotte's coming out. To goof around with her brother. Love that for her. Um, Graham has gone and put himself to bed at half nine at night. Honestly, this kid is so lonely. Like, I, I, I feel awful saying it, but like he has nothing to do. Literally, other than play games. <gasps> Charlotte is finally popular in school. Love that for her. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Just turn it off. Just turn it off. Um, you can go use the toilet. Why don't you go play pretend on the kitchen? Aw, thank you, Annie. I'm so in love with how detailed your gameplay and family house is. Storytelling queen. Oh, you're so cute. Thank you. I work on that the very, very hard. So I'm glad it I'm glad it comes across. Why is Reese feeling so angry? Oh, he hates the wind too. Well God, don't live in Italy because it's always windy here in Sims. Oh, Emiliano's crying in bed. Okay, Neve, can you come in here? Oh my god, he's crying in bed. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of her angry mood look because I don't feel like she'd be as angry anymore. I'm gonna have her come in here and try and console him because he's just, oh, he's not feeling very good. Mm. 
Okay, deep thoughts. Um, how can we make him feel better? Honestly, about to lose her mind. Okay, go and give him a hug. And then, can we talk to him about his sadness? Discuss sad mood. There we go. Honestly, Neve out here carrying this whole damn family. Look at him. Maybe a bit of woohoo will make him feel better. <laughs> and then we'll hug him lovingly. I want to get him out of the sad mood later if I can. Oh, babe. Affection. Soothing snuggle. Oh my god, Charlotte is now very popular. This girl is popping off. How is her social bunny doing, actually? I haven't even checked her social bunny recently. Um, let's have a look. Any posts? Okay, Charlotte literally posted up. Charlotte knows how to make me smile. As Like, what? Um, mm -mm -mm. Who knew that taking pillows to the face could be so thrilling? It's not a phase. Jeez. Oh, it's so cringy. Oh, it hurts. Oh, it really does. Okay. Oh, Tamia said your style is everything. Teach me your ways. Oh, Raylan said, thank you for being so supportive of my goal, Charlotte. Oh, cutie. Yeah. Give her a little, give her a little heart. And then, yes, queen. Happy. You basically have no followers. Shake my, a uh, Cameron. What's this? Screw Cameron. She's being rude. Okay, new message. I'm going to send a cute message to Tamia. Send her a little flirty message because she was nice. And then I'm also going to send a message to Raylan. A little flirty message. Let me take you to Plum Bite Pier. I've got a seat on the cuddle cards reserved just for you. Ooh, girl. <laughs> okay, um, Cameron, you're getting a mean message, babe. So you're getting a mean message. Shake my head. I can't believe you right now. Exactly. <laughs> and Regina. Yeah, friendly message. Regina, just checking in. I hope you're having a wonderful day. And then we'll have a new post. Make a little random post. Let's just do a nice happy narrative because everything's great. What did she say? Feeling extra bougie today. <laughs> I love her. Literally such a main character. I love this girl so freaking much. Okay, go and apply some facial cleanser. Oh my God, Reese, get out of here. Go to bed, seriously. <laughs> Actually, the Riz. <laughs> Everything is great, not not her family breaking down. I love how it's just like, what a happy narrative, like selling it online when really everything behind the scenes is awful, you know, like, <laughs> I love it. No way, wait, shake, SMH means shake my head. All this time I thought it meant somehow. No way. <laughs> no, I'm pretty, uh, guys, am I right in saying that it, it does mean shake my head? Imagine all this time I've been getting it wrong. Imagine all this time it's been, it's been me. Um, who knows? It could be. Did you do your homework? No, she did not. Okay, I'm gonna have her sit down and do her homework. Um, have her compose an analytical argument. Honestly, I feel like she'd argue really well. Um, and Ginger, um, you need to do your homework too. Go um, practice your vocabulary. Yeah, it does mean shake your head, right? Yeah. <laughs> Naomi's just living, <laughs> like living in a different, a different world right now. I mean, I never looked it up. Oh, I did have to look it up. I did have to look it up when it started getting used like more online. I definitely did. Yeah, to be fair, if you're French, yeah. Oh my God, can <sighs> Queenie, please don't do that. Please don't do that, Queenie. Queenie, stop. Okay, go clean this up. Oh my god, Queenie has finally learned not to play in trash after she's like an elder and she's literally about to pass away. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's awful, but also like we needed you to do that like ages ago. Okay, you go sleep. <laughs> I didn't know what IRL meant for a long time when I found out it means in real life. I lost it. The thing is, is like you look at it and you're like, what could it mean? When no one's told you what it means, like it makes no sense at all. You know, you can't never figure it out until you like look up what it means. And you're like, oh, that makes so much sense now. But you just have to look at it for a bit. <laughs> I'm just checking if anyone that I should know has just started a pregnancy from the looks of it. No one. No, I think we're good. No one that I'm friends with or family members have started doing anything. So that's great. Okay, kids, you girls go off to sleep. Okay, my loves. 
I have been streaming for nearly three hours tonight because I have actually been having the best time ever. I'm not even gonna lie. This has actually been so fun. But I really need to go because it is literally um, 12.15 for me. So I need to get out of here. So I love you guys so much. Thank you for joining me today. Today has been a really, really fun episode. Uh, I'm actually really excited for the next episode as well because we're gonna be going to prom with the teenagers since they've got prom. Uh, so that's going to be really, really fun. I've also got loads more ideas for like story ideas that I want to play out. Obviously, today was just starting off going to school. So yeah, I've got lots and lots of uh, lots and lots of ideas or something. I'm just going to save the game while we chat. So I love you guys so much. Thank you for joining me. If you guys do want to watch this stream back, if you missed any of it or you was late, anything like that, um, then the stream will be going up tomorrow on my second channel, More Miss Lollipop. If you want the link to it, type in exclamation mark YT VODs with no spaces in the chat. You'll get the link to the YouTube channel. Go ahead and subscribe over there. Um, and yeah, hopefully tomorrow uh, evening, probably about 6 to 8 p.m. my time, I should have my gameplay um, review of The Sims 4 for Rent Pack coming out. So if you guys want to see that, I know a lot of you guys have been asking in the Discord about where my review is going to be. So it will be out hopefully tomorrow. Um, although it is Ben's birthday, not tomorrow, the day after. So I've got like stuff to go out and get. So hopefully um, it won't go out too late tomorrow night because I still got to do some editing on it. But anyways, I love you guys. Thank you for joining me today. Um, if you guys did enjoy today's video, remember to go ahead and leave it a like. Subscribe down below if you are new and let me know what you thought of today's video. Let me know what you think of all the kiddos so far. Uh, also, let me know if you've got any good story ideas as well. Any ideas that you want me to play out with Charlotte, Reese, Graham or... Um, Ginger. <laughs> it took me way too long to think about that. I love you guys so much and I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye guys.